likely to give Cincinnati credit. They were tough today. The Warren Moon is known for 4,000 yards against him in his career to Drew Hill and Ernest Gibbons and Haywood Jeffries and, of course, Gary Wellman, the first guy you think of when you think of Warren Moon throwing the ball. Well, Wellman was busy in the first drive, catches a couple. This one gets it down to the 16. And then Warren Moon goes to Wellman. Hey, who needs Drew Hill? Wellman. Touchdown, 7-0 Oilers for the, uh, but the Bengals have a receiver, Tom. Yeah, and a great receiver emerging for the Bengals. He scored four of their TDs this year, four of the six TDs that they have. And as you watch him work here with Jay Schrader, you see, again, the package of size and the strength where it takes more than one guy to get you down. He caught seven balls today. Look at how slow but accurate Schrader's passes to Jeff Query. And uh, Houston leads only 76. Actually, the Bengals lead it 12-7 late third. But minutes into the fourth, <laughs> Jay Schrader, the fumble, the Oilers recover. They were deep another time, the fumble, the Oilers recover. Then Warren Moon, when you get time, Tom. He throws a nice ball, Chris. Yep, and watch he finds, it's not Gary Wellman, it's Hayward Jeffrey. And a touchdown, and I, I tell you, Warren Moon and the Oilers were sweating this one out for a while. The Bengals were game, but in the end, they were the Bengals walking like Egyptians once again, and they remain winless. The Oilers beat them by the count of 28 to 17, uh, 301 to 144.